Thanks for rejoining me for part two of concept mapping with Google Docs drawings. In part two, we'll go over other types of formatting, including adding word art and adding background colors to your concept map. And then we'll also talk about final products. So we've already created the concept map, or started to anyway, and we've added an image from a Google image search. Now we'd like to add some word art. Click on insert and word art. The box opens up where you can type in your text. Let's say Google Docs drawings rule. Again we hit enter and it inserts our word art. Now we can drag this around to move it. We can increase the size, change the size. Let's drag it down to the bottom so we can work with it a little bit. Notice that the colors it's picked up are the same colors as our title colors. If we'd like to change those, we can. Let's change the font first. We have lots of fonts to choose from. I'm going to pick Impact for this one. And then we can choose the color. Let's make it orange. We'll choose our fill color. Let's make that green. We can choose a different line width, and we can make it a solid line. So there, we've added some word art to our concept map. And finally, if we'd like to change the background color, we simply click on Format, Background. Now you can choose from some of these pre-selected colors, or you can choose a custom color. Let's select a nice blue color. It gives you a sample here. I like that, so we'll say OK. And there we go. Well, what about final products? As with any other Google document, you have the option of sharing your drawing with individuals or groups so that you can collaborate. After all, these are fun and you want to share the fun. You can print out your document. You need to print it out as a PDF. You can email it as an attachment or you can even publish it to the web. To share, simply click on the pull down menu Choose from Share Settings, where you can set your visibility. You can add collaborators. You can email it as an attachment, or go ahead and publish it out on the web. Thanks for joining me in this session. Look forward to seeing you again.